Hello everyone. Welcome to our course for January 2020. Welcome Dr. Reda. Welcome Dr. Salah. Uh, we are starting now. So as you see, we are four admins with you. Dr. Salah is giving lectures. Uh, and Dr. Reda also is give you lectures. Uh, me is, would do with your revision. And Dr. Hamad Rida is who is the one who is, about, so, uh, who is doing the book for you and for the drive and everything, everything for the book. So, Dr. Rida, can you, can you talk? Okay, I will start. Okay, uh, team members are Dr. Salah al -Sayed. Uh, as you know, Dr. Salahi has been helping many people in passing part A and B, and he has got his own group, and Dr. Shunda is an OSCE organizer who is already has been helping many people by WhatsApp groups. And I, uh, Dr. Reda, I give some lectures, and I will be with you till the end and your journey to UK, inshallah. Also, Dr. Muhammad, Reda, he is very well known uh, surgeon in UK, giving very good uh, lecture in communication and history taking, and he will give you very clear lecture about the UK system and how communication should be together with the person. Okay, so we have many groups and the first is www dot mrcscourses.net slash team okay you can subscribe the course from here you can take samples from here and also you can see if the schedule will be apparent here the schedule is made for you to watch anytime this is the course schedule you can download it from here okay Everything is clear here about the schedule, about how to be the communication done, how every lecture should be on time. Okay, this is a previous course, and each course has its own schedule. If you go for uh, subscribe now, you can subscribe. If you can go to the old feedbacks about part A and B, you can go for feedback. Okay. If you are going to frequently ask the questions about the course and the exam, you can find here on the facts, frequently asked questions. This is the feedback from about our course. Many of these people are well-known surgeons like Dr. Muhammad Tahir, who is a friend of Dr. Sarahi, is a well-known surgeon in UK and in India. Also, Dr. Hatton, he is a very good surgeon in OSCE. Dr. Sam, who is Magdi, Dr. Magdi Akub, the heart surgeon. Dr. Rahim al Nagar, he is very well known, who has the highest score uh, in part A in uh, the previous two courses with us. Okay, so this course is very uh, nice for you to start and it's very concise. How it's concise, I will tell you. Okay, the OSCE is very easy to pass without courses. As we said, I know many people from Sudan and from uh, Egypt pass without courses. So you can pass without courses, but if you want a concise plan, targeted plan in two up to five months period preparation of preparation, then you have to be inside any course. I think I has not supposed to uh, to recommend my course or our course or Dr. Shmuda or Dr. Salah course or the Ruda course. No, you just think why we? Because we are making development. If you came for me one year ago, then I will tell you our course is if you will try with us. But now we have many centers. For, for practice in UK, in Egypt, Cairo, in 
kingdom of Saudi Arabia with Dr. Salah and in Oman maybe with Dr. Shmuda. Also in Bahrain and Emirates, you will have this uh, hands-on. It's a practice and hands-on is very important, okay? First, the, the first we have knowledge part and we have skills part. We have in knowledge, anatomy, pathology, critical care, and in skills we have procedural skills, examination, history taking, and communication skills. Each station from three stations anatomy by 20 marks any station by 20 marks like you see here in the button of the schedule or the this is by the way it's not made by me it is from the, web, the official website of the exam so you can download it okay pathology two stations and critical care so this is the knowledge area then we have skills communication skills home code and communication with patient. We have two procedure skills. We have four examination stations and two history taking stations. If you can study doctor exam, GK Medics with you, you can pass easily, but it's not from the first time because you have to have some people to make you full, fully oriented about how the exam could be, how is the rang how should i treat with the time management how i update myself about the new stations in each center i think you must be enrolled inside any course or with your friends we will give you a records book the last five years the updates made continuously by dr salah by me and by dr muhammad Reda and dr Shmuda. continuous making making you updated and up to date like penang exam last exam what is the stations what is the new stations apart from the old stuff so you have to have some group to update you and the best one in this area is dr salah really he, he is very oriented about this and he is giving very good part of his time for this area i'm trying to help because many exams and many candidates if you can check here this is the previous ssr okay here in this area this is the ssr by the way ssr is an abbreviation of Salah, Shimuda, Reda, and Reda. So here you have many people asking continuously, many exams coming today, many of the new questions you have to update. So you have to think positively like, no, I will go for the exam without courses. Yes, you can. I couldn't say, no, 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 you must have courses. It's easy. And I have plan how to pass okay so everything is done by updates so those 162 member in this course and the previous course would above 205 persons in our course so i think you must have very good course to pass the first time no time to waste And also how the anatomy will start, how the pathology should start, how I, I should answer in press protocol course, what is the news chart, like this chart, and by the Royal Group of Physicians and used in surgical works, and it will find the preparatory station with the file of the patient up above 15 pages made like this. So you have to be oriented about what is the news score, is that important? No news, no news. In UK, we say no news, no news. Means 
no national early warning score chart, then no news about the patient. So this news will decide how the patient should go. Okay. If you can talk, Dr. Salah, if you are free now. السلام عليكم معاك يا باشا كمل كمل دكتور رضا معاك لا لا يلا جو اون اتس يور تايم طيب السلام عليكم جميعا جود ايفنينج ايفري بودي ااا سانكو دكتور رضا ااا ان ذا بيجينينج اوكي سو Mainly for part three, depending on your practice, we will give you the knowledge which will be more than sufficient for the exam. But how you will express the knowledge in the exam? How you will tell the answer? Uh, by the way, some of you, they will have some books or some things or some materials sharing from other courses, from doctor exam, what the Mars is. Now it's free for all young men. Even this is not logic, and to somebody is doing his course and he's doing great effort even we are competing him or her uh, and you are distributing as a material or looking for this material anyhow uh, we know what will happen so we keep our book not sufficient so if you will depend only in the book you can pass but you will miss many things so better to attend the lectures this is the first point After the book. Second is practice with us. Third is hands on. So we know from other courses how to improve you. After the book, book is not sufficient. Again and again, uh, Dr. Muhammad Rada is excellent by the way in this job and he wants to update his book. But we know what will happen. This book will be distributed for all. We know that. So better to be not sufficient. So Anybody will depend on the book, you will miss many things. This is the first point. Uh, what we will add? Uh, I contacted Dr. Muhammad Rada yesterday to add some new special, more uh, Hepatitis C virus done by Dr. Rada Harbi. Uh, this uh, just in January. Nobody, by the way, nobody uh, from other courses knows about this station. Okay? So some, some stations will be added. About three or four stations, new will add in the book. Okay, I will collect all and send it to Muhammad Rada to update. So the drive, your drive will be updated. But what about the updates? What about the reality checklist? What about all these things? Now, Dr. Rada shared for you just the Dublin exam in the screen. Just the Dublin exam uh, two days ago. Two days ago. They have around four or five coaches. Okay, four or five coaches. New, new coach, new station, hand examination was new station. Uh, doctrine contraction, this was new, by the way. And they came in Dublin. And any new station coming in, uh, anywhere, expected to come to your exam. So I will discuss now about, uh, first about uh, centers. Centers. Uh, what is the business center? First, for all of you, you should finish before month eight. So you have uh, two centers now for all of you, two centers. Who's in, in, in Saudi Arabia or uh, around Saudi Arabia or in, in the Gulf area? He can go for Dubai. 27, month six. Four months are enough? Yes. Again, four months are enough? Yes. Or others can go for career exam, month eight, August. August. Please try to finish in this. All will join our course. Please try to finish in these two uh, centers. Uh, good centers, yes. Uh, 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 Dubai exam is uh, Ireland, was Ireland, and this is a good center, fair center. I, uh, because I make my exam in, uh, in Bahrain, was Ireland, and also our candidates in Bahrain, many, many of our candidates in Bahrain, so this is a good center, Dubai. Rahim and Nagar. Buzz, this is the center, Dr. Alana, Islam. We have uh, around the eight candidates last time, six of them passed. Okay, this is in Dubai. Uh, Cairo, 
It's a very good center. We have around the 29, 25. Last course, 25, 19 bus in Cairo. 19 or 18, I think, yeah. bus in Cairo. Okay. Uh, uh, this regarding this center stuff. Who will go for other centers? Who will go for other? Centers? You have Delhi, I think, month seven. We have some candidates who will go in uh, Edinburgh, I think, on month five. I have two or three. They contacted me. These two people who will go for month five before end of the course, we will send uh, uh, other lectures for them to finish early, maybe on April. We and we will try to finish with them on uh, on April. Okay. Uh, <coughs> part B. We will start by the book. So you have two lectures weekly. Two lectures weekly. Uh, you should finish from the lecture every lecture around the two to three hours. In this course, we will do something. Uh, I think we will try with you first. We will try to start the knowledge by recording lectures. And for knowledge, will not be live. Okay? Why? We wanted to give you in the beginning three lectures weekly, not two only. I still I will discuss with Dr. Shinoda and Dr. Da for that. Okay? We want for knowledge because no many updates except the new stations we will add for you. So we will try to do that. For knowledge, I think previous course are excellent, or knowledge stations are excellent. So, and I think we'll try with upper limb lecture and we'll see. We'll see upper limb, we'll get the feedback from you. No, I think better to attend the life according to you, don't worry. Okay, so we'll try to do that first. To finish early. After lecture, you will go writing. After us, what is the update, what everything we told, more extra than the book. Then finish. So if you will study, if you will study, the lecture, two hours. Then instead of the lecture, after that, two hours, you will finish within four hours from the lecture. You have four hours for the first lecture and the fourth for the second lecture. So weekly, you will have eight hours of study. You have time in part B, not like part A. But the most, of, most important problem in part B is practice. Don't extend your knowledge. Don't extend your knowledge. You want a doctor exam? You want to pass the MRCS? Any book you want, we can send it for you. We can send it for you. I have in, in my drive more than 50 books. Really, I read most of them. Use this. Don't extend your knowledge. That is enough only. You will go to the station, you will surprise. You will, when you will go to the station, it's going like we are discussing. I will tell you, in the Bahrain exam, you have in our book high sensitivity and the high specificity test. It's written in parotic, in pastology. If you will read the question, and there is the answer. The answer in the book, by the way, is wrong. The answer in our book is wrong. So what happened for our candidates? We corrected them. Yeah, we are correcting some things for them, for you. What happened in the Bahrain exam? Most of candidates, as I told, the wrong answer. Except we have two or three who went for Bahrain, they told this answer. High specificity and high sensitivity. The examiner was surprising. And they told me, these stations are going dimically, like, like we discussed, like we discussed. Okay, so in our course, you have our book, you have all the updates will be discussed in the lecture. You have practice after finishing of the course, it will be around one month, and you have the hands on. Inshallah, it will be for the exam. Who's going for Dubai exam? Who 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 will go for Dubai exam? I will do hands on in, in Saudi Arabia after Eid. It will be beginning of month six. I am planning to put it on beginning of month six. And who's going for Cairo exam? We will do beginning of month eight. So beginning of six, beginning of eight, it will be hands on here. For uh, UK centers, Dr. Reda will arrange for you. Yani for Cairo and the KSA, we arrange it. Me and Dr. Reda, Dr. Reda will join us in Cairo exam. In Cairo hands on, it's okay. And if we'll be in UK, he will arrange his hands on before your exam. According to your center, we are arranging that for you. Tamam? Okay, Dr. Rida. Okay, uh, Dr. Salah, thank you. Okay, now, like Dr. Salah said, the checklist for the game of asking short questions. This game we are oriented about because of the experience of the tutors from Dr. Salah to Dr. Shmuda to Dr. Muhammad Reda and
Kim is dynamic, is a book. No, the book is precise. The book is in, in a dynamic process. This means that if you will go to the drive, then you will find the book, let blank pages for adding the updates of the each exam. So you will be oriented about above 90%. And I can say more, but I, 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 I don't exaggerate if I say that more than 90% will be with you. Okay, now hands on, so the real checklist, the hands on, and hands on is not only in Cairo, it's in UK, we arranged in Manchester, okay, and Dr. Salah is going to arrange in uh, KSA and Dr. Shnuda in Cairo, and now we are very professional. Thank God the progress of the course make us like we, we don't stop in a point, like the book is dynamic, we are dynamic. The book is multiply, multiple questions are added, but according to the centers. And the surprise is the are repeated on the book. We are doing the organization book. The highly updated material. Okay. We have done this time. We have bought every procedure skills practice, like Doppler. Many people like participating, like how to use Doppler. Like this, we have bought many uh, sections and many items from this, and uh, all of that. And made every course we do that, uh, and we develop like the book. Okay. If you went to how to pass the exam. Okay, then I will tell you something. Again, again and again. We have the schedule is made systematic like you see. And nothing more. Like, I'm, not, I'm afraid the question, uh, quest, new questions will come. Definitely new questions will come. But apart from or about more than 90%, you will be updated about. It. Okay, so you have Maybe you read Dr. Exam and pass the MRCS, and many people, uh, they give you our book like a gift. You can read it, and they passed in us, like me, doctor, passed in our course, and they are giving the same material for you in another course. No problem, but how to use the material and how to update the material with a continuous effort. Okay? First, you, you have to buy best knowledge by from 105 to 110 from 160. For skills part, and this is the most complicated part, so that we have been developing ourselves in the practice part. Like, why you live? It is OSCE. Now, OSCE live, and many people best with this live only because of the updates. And I thought. The section. Okay, so skills bar, my best this mark from 107 to 132 from 200 in skills. How to pass this? By continuous study, daily continuous study. Okay, you can find many reviews about us if you are not confident about starting with us. You can look to Dr. Uh, Dr. Salah Beige uh, or Mar Beige, and then you can find how many people you can get on Dr. Afsik, Dr. Ahmed, and many people does the most recently in many exams, and check with them. It, is our course worthy to start with? And I think because they already passed with us. Okay, uh, now I will show you the, the pass mark. Okay, if you can talk to Dr. Salah while I'm showing the pass mark, not to make this lecture more than Okay, uh, regarding the pass mark, you have the uh, in knowledge, eight stations, and then skills, ten stations. Eight and ten. These eight stations, every station by 20 marks, so total one skill. And in skills, you have 
10 stations, every station by 20 marks, so total 200. To pass the exam, you can get zero in one station, and still you have a chance to pass. So if you will do bad in any station, please forget it. Still, you will not fail by one or two stations. You will not fail by one or two stations. Okay? You will fail at the last station because you became depressed. So the last question can make you pass or make you fail. Very important. Two, uh, if you will do any bad, any bad things in any station or you are, your, your, your performance is very bad, please forget it. Forget it. So I will come now for the skills, the three anatomy stations, three anatomy stations, three critical care stations, and two uh, basology. And two basology. Uh, total, one skist to bus, total is between around 110. Around 110. 110 from one skist. 110 from one skist. Can be increased by three markers or four markers, can be decreased by this. This fix. fix. Okay? For uh, skills, you have 200 marks, 200 marks to bus. You should score around 130, around 130, 130. Increase the by three or four markets and decrease the by three or four markets. Can be this or this. In all centers all over the world, by the way. To pass the exam, you should pass the two sections separately. Yeah, you should pass skills and you should pass knowledge. If you will pass one and fail another one, you are failed, so you, you will repeat all the exam again. This is the percentage of pass. Knowledge. Don't worry. You will have everything. You will find only one examiner. You will sit in front of him for anatomy, for critical care, for pathology. You will have the checklist in front of him and they will ask you. Then you will answer. Then get the mark. Any question will take explanation. More than one minute, you are in the wrong way. Every question, every, like ping pong, every question will take me less than one minute. Bus of physiology of what? Okay, I will explain. No. No. Every question is in one minute, less than one minute, please. So if you will find any question in our book extended, this to understand. Make your, un your own answer and from our explanation and tell the examiner, okay? And any question, you can't answer it, you don't know, tell him, pass. Khalas, I don't know. After finishing of the station, he will ask you to come back for the question you missed. So if you, if you don't know any question, don't think. I don't know. Next. Or pass. So is this in knowledge? What would, what would happen in knowledge? Nine minutes for the examiner. One minute outside building is a stem. Nine minutes. One minute outside. Then nine minutes inside. You should finish from all the questions. You should finish from all the questions. Okay? It will be exactly like our book. For sure. Okay? For sure. Uh, and yeah, the question, he will ask you then your answer. Khalas, finish. This is the knowledge part. For the skill part, uh, many things will interfere. Your performance, your self-confidence, your communication. A patient will tell you, ah, oh, I have pain. You should tell him, I am so sorry for that. I can stop my examination and prescribe for you analysis if you want, if you wish. Okay? This, you are taking markers for that. Washing your hands. Taking marks, thanking the patient at the end, and offer for him for redress. You are taking marks for this. You are surprised in full catheterization in the skill. When you are inserting the full catheterization, uh, you have actor and you have model. Insert the catheter. It's okay. Uh, just when you are putting the gel, actor will shout, "Oh, you know how many marks." For this, four marks, communication. You know, really, four marks. When patient is shouting, you should tell him, I'm so sorry, we should wait five minutes for the action of numbing the agent. And he's waiting only to emphasize with him, to tell him, I'm so sorry, I can wait. And to tell him you, that you should wait five minutes for the action of the local uh, anesthetic or numbing agent. How to take the consent? For this catheterization. Today, I have been asked to insert an elastic tube through your urine passage. All of this will be under aseptic technique and under numbing agent to feel no pain. 
is this okay for you? This is the way to take the consent. Lee main language, explaining the procedure clearly for the patient. So many things interfering in skills. So skills will take big part of us, and all of the skills will be live lectures. Also, practice will be done for this skills. And plus, the hands on this is the importance now of hands on. When you will come, you will go for Dr. Rida, for Dr. Shinoda, for me, according to the center, we will decide. Very important, we will do skills, procedure, and examination to show you how to manage this situation. Even we will tell this in the lecture, we will tell this in the practice revision. Okay? So skills, this is not our part now to discuss. It will come. Don't be panicked. Why? How can be? How I manage all these things? You have no knowledge, no study in, in skills. You have no knowledge or study. Six minutes, examine exhibition. Seven minutes, a discussion with the examiner. History, six minutes, taking history. Three minutes of discussing with the examiner. What is the question with the exam? What is your diagnosis? What is the differential? How to investigate, how to treat? Same questions, every exam, by the way. But your approach in history taking, your approach in communication, your approach in skills, in procedure, okay? This is what we will do practice, and this is our, uh, really, this is a very uh, powerful point in our course. Yeah, knowledge, you can read from anywhere even we are updating. But for skills, we are doing really, we are doing great job, especially in skills. So you will go uh, and you, you know everything, how to manage, what is a scheme in history taking, what is a scheme in procedure, uh, in procedure, what is a scheme in examination, or somatic. Look, feel, move, special test, class. Even new station will come for you, how to do, how to do elbow examination. This is not coming before. Like shoulder examination, by the way. Shoulder examination came in UK. Last two months. Okay? Shoulder, well, this new station. How to do, even, you, do, you are not also ready. Look, feel, move. I will look from front, from behind, from the side. Feel, I will feel temperature, tenderness, the joint lines, uh, uh, effusion, like this way. Move, a uh, passive movement and active movement. <laughs> you see, you finished from this station without preparing. So our scheme in, in examination, even, even in examination, it will be very easy for you. Okay, okay Dr. Roda. Okay, Dr. Salah, I can put a Lucia uh, number for you. She passed with 172 in skill section. And many people went and asked her, have you studied any section apart from the course? She said, no. I studied only the updates and the book and your notes. And this is very bad. Why? Because many people are distracting by materials. In part A, for example, I prepared seven months and I just got 74 percentage with maximum effort, with telegram group. So I don't know what, what, what should I, I study, like uh, Oxford book or Bailey and Love or the past test or the EMR test. I don't know which part is important and which is not. I started in 2017 to study in part A. For part B, I studied with many notes. Give me the notes of this and the notes of this and I was too distracted. So these courses with some people who already being distracted for you and before you. Like, this is not discovered, like, take this material and study and you will pass. You have to find how to pass that, okay? For you to pass is just concise study from the book for anatomy, you will listen to the lecture, study. You have only two stress. Why? Because two lectures a week. So if you are going for the Arabian board, for your master's degree, for your, your PhD, you need just, I have finished MRCS part B in two months from the first, and I'm not, I'm not super, I'm telling you that I prepared for, for part A in seven months. Okay, but in part B, only two months. So part B, very easy to pass, if you have some people to tell you how to pass. Okay. So, anatomy, just concise, 
دكتور صلاح and me and دكتور محمد and دكتور شنودة will orient you about how the examiner should ask you. You have to know that each question has a short answer and the, the six minutes of the station, six to nine minutes, will end before you starting saying an easy question answer. So we will try to make you oriented with how even to answer. If you know the answer, it's not the clue. It's how to, the, like in my exam, I have been asked about uh, what is the definition of adenoma? I said it is benign tumor of the glandular epithelium. She said, no, no, it's not tumor. And I tried just for one minute to try and its lesion, it's, it was not satisfied. You know, he, it's not about his satisfaction. It's about the, past, the, the checklist. Like you said, Dr. Salah, a checklist is very important. Like you know the word, you need New Blasia. He needed the new Blasia word. It is a benign new Blasia. So uh, he is not. He wasn't satisfied with uh, benign lesion. It is new Blasia. How to know that from the checklist? Checklist means that the examiner is not controlling the mark. The checklist itself that would be controlling the mark. So. I have finished. I have nothing to say apart from you will pass with a very nice score from the beginning. If you just one week, two days study. Two days in a one week. See the schedule again. Yeah, for the centers, I, I, I leave that, uh, Dr. Salah try to explain the centers because many people say, which center? Uh, I should go for Sheffield, for London, for UK. After you finish, Dr. Salah, I will tell them that it's not about the center. We, we know from the international exams that be away from UK centers and they try from like Kuala Lumpur, like Cairo, Bahrain, Emirates, man just and dr wajid for example he buzzed he buzzed in 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 uk center and many people buzz in uk center so from these centers i like Malambu, Cairo, oman bahrain emirates but i don't like uk i don't know why because some people telling you that royal college of surgeons of england is different from edinburgh this left uh, for you uh, okay, so Thursday, Saturday, Wednesday, Saturday. So it's two lectures a week. Saturday, Wednesday, Saturday, Wednesday. So you will be very, um, it's not like part A, don't worry about, uh, no, it's a question posting. It's because part A is a wide range of knowledge for all of you. But this part B is very easy and it's doable, don't worry. Okay, go on the tutorial. So let the doctor Salah lift the, I think he will be for this hand on tomorrow. Uh, so uh, we we like if one if one have any questions. You can open the mic and you can, you can answer him over here. The lecture will be a valuable one. It is uploaded in the Zoom as usual. Uh, we will start by Saturday as our schedule. And wish you a good luck with us. Any questions? Okay, I think we will stop now here. And we will see you on Saturday. And the group is open to any questions you want to ask. And again, we'll come to our journey. Dr. Salah, 
You want to add any issue before you close? Dr. Rada, you want to add an yes, issue? Uh, I, uh, yeah, I want to add something. Please try to finish MRC part B. Don't wait until someone will give you... No, no, you will pass. It's, it's not 100% that we pass. But uh, let, let's see the pass rate and ask people about how you pass. Then, what daily concise study just two week, two days a week. With practice, you will start with anatomy, pathology, critical care, then finish knowledge. Then while you are doing the practice for the skills and this, you will never finish. Okay, I know many, some people fail from knowledge, but the majority will fail from practice. So practice is a play. Practice is a game. You have to do daily practice. You have to do uh like uh orientation for yourself how like for me starting with cranial nerve examination we will we doing that in 10 minutes at the beginning and we are dropping many items later on it became only four minutes all cranial nerve examination in four minutes and unconscious so unconscious with unconscious level, you will reach to make very good level in examination. Okay, if you want to add something, Dr. Salah or Dr. Kmudu, I have finished. I just, I just telling you that don't be afraid from asking. I, Dr. Ahmed Awara, he is intern and passed from the first time. Dr. Many doctors, they are intern and they told us it's very easy. They attend the OSCE hands on. And before then, many people passed without on, with only online. Uh, just information from us. We will give you the videos of how to do this examination. You will do it first. You will draw, and later on, you will keep every item. Okay. Yeah. Have okay, Dr. Da. Sorry, I left because tomorrow is uh, hands on in Saudi Arabia, like you know. Uh, and really, I am so busy today, Allah. I don't want uh, we want to post one lecture, but I know you are waiting us. So sorry, guys. Well, I really I have uh, I I told what I wanted to tell, and even during the course we will tell more and more, inshallah. But because I am busy with preparing everything, we will start tomorrow and after tomorrow. The hand is on for KCA for people who is going for March exam. So I'm so sorry. I I will leave now, inshallah. Uh, I think the doctor definitely from everything, Dr. Shinoda also. And uh, we will clarify in every section how to answer the question, how anatomy is coming, how pathology is, is coming in the exam. And like anatomy is coming like cadaver or plastic model or CT or MRI or X-rays or bone. We will tell all these issues during every section, inshallah. Okay? Yeah, we are showing Not the picture. Inshallah, inshallah. We are showing the picture of your preparation now, Dr. Salah. Yes. Well, I have to finish the fagr. 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 Adibi, I have a Nigerian guy. He's very excellent. This is amazing. He's preparing for not tying. He's preparing for not tying. He's doing some things for not tying, for not at depth. He's been, he's been preparing all these things now, today. So we take time, I like to prepare this. Because, inshallah, for your course, I will buy all the instruments from uh, the online. Dr. Rada will, will show me. And I will prepare everything to be with you. Not like I am preparing how to do not tying, so preparing myself. So every everything will be prepared, inshallah, in Saudi Arabia for who's going to Dubai. And also in Cairo will be also prepared. I think Dr. Rada prepared already and Dr. Shinoda for the skills is here. For the procedure. Already, already a very nice place. I will show you the Dr. Shunda's nice place. Uh, yes, Dr. Rada. 
Thank you for this good presentation and good preparation. Yeah. Is our uh, hands-on course to be in this area? To the Egyptian, the Egyptian area, by the way. Yeah, uh, smile as you will die. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Nice. See, see you all in the course, inshallah. Thank you, Dr. Rudolf, for the amazing presentation. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Dr. Salah, for very concise knowledge. See you, guys. Thank you all. Now we close, which is the end, and we close now. See you, inshallah. Bye-bye.